So now we're gonna go into our mind palace. Right, we hit the start button. We use the left bumper button to toggle over to the mind palace. And now you see here, we have, we're using the left toggle stick to surf it or to surf through these different clues that we have. And then what you have to do is you pick one clue, you hit A to lock it in, and then you find a second clue that connects to the first clue and, and forms like one thought that you have about the case that you're you know, the case that you're working on, right? So, uh, you know, we could say here like Albert returned unstable. So if you're playing the game, obviously you are. Uh, you know what they're talking about here. You know, he went on an expedition and he returned mentally unstable. So that's the clue we want to connect something to, right? And then we'll say, well, uh, you know, the fishermen all suffered a sudden psychotic outbreak after Albert regained consciousness. So we think maybe that's connected to Albert returning unstable. Maybe there's a connection to this sort of psychotic outbreak that they're having. So we click A on that one. And then it tells us we're correct. We connected two clues correctly and Albert spread the hysteria around him from when he returned. So that's it. Now we have that connection, right? We go back to the clues and we can, we can repeat that process, find two other clues that connect, and then we can, using the Y button, go back and we find the different conclusions that we've reached and uh, the deductions we made for those clues. So that's, that's the Mind Palace, very important part of the game, obviously, and that's how you use it. Uh, you may make mistakes. When you do make a mistake, you know, you say, well, I'm going to connect this clue and this clue. Oh, that's incorrect. And so the game tells you that, you know, it tells you right there. No, that's incorrect. It turned red. So then you've got to go back and and try again. I don't know if there's any kind of penalty for that at the end. I don't know if you get any kind of grade like you did in the Sherlock games, but you know, it's going to happen. That's what happens when you make an incorrect conclusion or you try to link two clues together that don't belong together. And that's the Mind Palace. So uh, pretty cool game so far. Hope you guys are enjoying it and uh, hope that helps you navigate around the Mind Palace.